<laughs> I'm doing great. It's great to be here in Param, especially at this beautiful location, and great to see the governor. Why did you decide to come out? Oh, it's to support Param, but also to support our governor. And uh, I think he's doing great things, and he fully funded our autism program. And I was down at the legislature lobbying for these families, and uh, he kind of put me out of work to, for doing that. But obviously, I have a lot to do at NBC. I know that uh, you're really for getting some funding for the autism, and that's yes. one of your major um, things that you're going yes. for. Tell about that. Well, we're excited because the governor did find uh, some extra money on the ad max, and so now we're going to be able to help those, not only the 174 that we've been helping, but the 300 and more that are on the waiting list. So we're very thrilled about that because, you know, now it's 1 in 110 or diagnosed autistic and that's not a crisis it's a catastrophe it really, is. it really is how can people get more involved and donate to this cause well we have a website autism coalition of nevada it's called acon acon dot org and i do hope people will participate obviously they can get hold of me at uh, KSNV News 3, and I will get them involved in any kind of project they want. <laughs> How's it going working for uh, NBC? Oh, I love it. You know, they're so good to me, and uh, they're real, really involved in the community and uh, do a lot to make a difference in people's lives. And it's just like you. You know, a lot of people look at the media as the fourth branch of government because we're the voice of the people. And on behalf of a mom who has a kid with autism, thank you so much for championing oh, thank you. And, and I hope that you're going to get the resources you need now because it has been a very big challenge. And let me tell you, we had a lot of sleepless nights working for that money. But Governor Brian Sandoval kept his promise and came through. Thank you.